Hey, I'm Madison. And I'm Lisa. Welcome back to your adventure. Now this week we're back in Acts chapter 2 again, looking at verse 42. So listen to the words and we'll see what we can take out of it. Peter had been telling people about Jesus and warning them about how to live a good life. Those who accepted his message were baptised and about 3,000 were added to their number that day. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and to fellowship, to the breaking of bread and to prayer. Everyone was filled with awe at the many wonders and signs performed by the apostles. All the believers were together and had everything in common. They sold property and possessions to give to anyone who had need. Every day they continued to meet together in the temple courts. They broke bread in their homes and ate together with glad and sincere hearts, praising God and enjoying the favour of all the people. And the Lord added to their number daily those who were being saved. So here we see in Acts 2 verse 42 that the disciples of course are devoted to the four things. Now we looked at teaching, being devoted to teaching last week. So this week we're looking at being devoted to fellowship. And fellowship, although it's an old fashioned word, it means to spend time with each other, to encourage each other, to laugh together, to speak about Jesus and to speak about his word and how we can reach other people for him. So, you know, it's important for every follower of Jesus to have fellowship with other people. Who you choose as your friends are important. Who you spend time with is important. Who you let influence you is important. And I don't know about you, but I want people who love Jesus to be influencing me, to be encouraging me, to be helping me in my journey. And that's why it's in there in Acts chapter 2, because the disciples seen that it was important for them to spend time with other believers, other followers of Jesus. So what kind of challenge can we get? from that. So my challenge to you this week is to arrange to have fellowship with your friends. So it might be to invite people around to your house or go out to play or just meet up with them at church but just be intentional and spend time with other Jesus followers this week and maybe even speak about some of the things that Jesus spoke about while you're with them. That is going to be a fun challenge. Yeah. Great, we we'll look forward to hearing your stories. See ya. Bye.